In this lesson, you'll learn how to work with the images you create during your digital styling sessions with Salon Styler. Once you've made your selection of hairstyles and fitted them to your model, you can save them to the gallery by clicking the Add to Gallery button. You can scroll through your gallery images two ways, by using the arrow keys on either side of the gallery, or by using the scroll bar at the bottom of the gallery. Notice how the time and date that the image was made appears when you leave the cursor on the gallery image. You can restore an image from the gallery to the working area by first clicking the image and then clicking this button. You can select an image in the gallery by clicking it. To select more than one image, hold down the control key while clicking the image that you want to select. You can remove selected images from the gallery by clicking the delete button. You can also remove all the images from the gallery by clicking this button here. Salon Styler will then ask you if you really want to do this. In our case, our lesson is not over, so we will click No. To save the images in the gallery, select the ones that you want to save and then click the Save as File button. You can then name the file and choose the file format. Salon Styler works with two file formats, JPEG and Bitmap. JPEG is a compression format, which means it does not take as much space to save it. If we choose JPEG, we can then choose the quality of the image. The higher the quality of the image, the larger the file size will be. 75 is a good balance between file size and quality, so we will click OK. Printing. To print the image in the working area, first set the area you wish to print by clicking this button and getting the printing frame. You can set the printing frame to help save your color ink cartridges when you print the image. Also, if you photograph your models with a light background, it will use less color ink. With the printing frame set, click Print on the menu to the left of the working area in a Print Manager window will appear. We can add text to the printout by using the text option. You can resize the image by dragging and clicking the image frame corners. Once you have it the way you like, click OK to print it out. You can print multiple images from the gallery by first selecting the ones you want, and then clicking the print button. Again, we can resize the images. Use the Restore option to return them to their original order. Salon Styler will allow you to print as many images to a page as you wish. With a click of a button, this button here, Salon Styler will create a slideshow of your model by automatically fitting all the hairstyles from your selected hairstyle library to the model one at a time. This feature can be used as a demonstration to attract clients to your salon.
You can place multiple images from the gallery to the screen by simply double-clicking them. This is very useful in helping your clients select the ones they like by eliminating the ones they don't. You can remove all of them from the screen at once by right-clicking the image bar and selecting Close All. The automatic selection button fits all the hairstyles in the selected library to the model and places them in the gallery. In Options, there are many features that are useful when working with the gallery. Morphing dissolves one hairstyle into another for a Hollywood effect. Restore the image from the gallery controls whether the gallery image opens up in the working area or in its own window when you double click it. Show only the selected view of hairstyle limits the library of hairstyles to the face view you have loaded. For example, if you select this with a three-quarter view, only the three-quarter view hairstyle will appear in the gallery. Full screen previews determines whether the print preview will be in the full screen or fitted in the working area. Show Layer Frame makes the hairstyle frame visible or invisible. When it is invisible, it still works for resizing the hairstyle, but you cannot see it. Show Gallery turns on and off the gallery. Show Warnings and Show Confirmation Windows turns on and off Warnings and Confirmation Windows. Slideshow setting controls the speed of the slideshow. With Auto Save selected, Salon Styler automatically saves the gallery as you work with it, so in case the computer is shut down by mistake during a modeling session, you will not lose your work. Returning to the menu to the left of the work area, we can select statistics to see how many modeling sessions there have been performed, how many pages have been printed, and how many total images have been printed. You now know how to work with the images you've created. In the next lesson, you'll learn how to customize the hairstyles.